All right, hey, Shalom, Akiam. First and foremost, like to give all praises to Yahweh, Bahashim Yahweh Shai, Bahashim Raka Padash. Double honors to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone. We are the Hebrew Israelites, which consists of the Negroes, Latinos, Native Americans, Simo Indians, West Indians, and Haitians. And according to the Holy Scriptures, we're God's chosen people. Um, coming back at you with another lesson. And what you're looking at is a true depiction of the one you're going to call Jesus Christ, whose real name in the Hebrew is Yahweh Shai. Okay? And what you're looking at is a true depiction of the one you're going to call God, whose real name in the Hebrew is Yahweh. So in these trying times, for the for those that's been selected, elected to make it, you have to call upon your power, man. You have to pray. You gotta have faith. Lord willing, we all endure until the very end to make it up out of here, man. Okay, so when you call upon your power, you have to say Yahweh, Bahashem Yahweh Shai, or Yahweh Wa Yahweh Shai. Wa means and, Bahashem means in the name. This is the Hebrew tongue. Okay, so in the wake of what's going on um, of this uh, this uh, Corona crisis, which is uh, deeper than the Corona crisis, you know, a lot of Jake, a lot of our people are waking up to what's really going on. It all links up with the Bible. This so-called white man has a agenda who are the biblical Edomites to bring in the new world order because they have been given a blessing to rule with the sword. And guess what? Their time is on. They have been given a, an appointed time by Yahweh by Shimei was shy to try to bring this thing in and they, they're, they're failing uh, drastically, which the new world order will fail. You understand, but the Mosai is going to allow them to get it in, man. So to speak, a lot of you wicked Israelites are going to die out here drastically. Okay, a lot of you Americans will die. It's going to be uproars of the people out here, people fighting over food, people killing one another for the lack of bread and lack of water. For us brothers in this faith, man, this these these are very exciting times for us. Yeah. Very exciting and scary. You got to keep a balance to it, because the scriptures say the righteous shall scarcely be saved, man. You understand? We about to witness some things we never seen before, but we not worried, man. I myself, the rest of the bros, we not from apostles, elders on down. We we embrace what's coming, man. We embrace what's happening right now, because the sooner the better. We shall be um, we 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 shall meet our Lord and Savior in in the sky, in the air. On, on that gigantic chariot that there, that's, that's being seen and the rest of the chariots that's being seen throughout out of space for those that's bid to the marriage so we about to be married again with our Lord and Savior and our, and our Father Yahweh you understand because the Mosai is liking us unto a chaste virgin so this is what this lesson is going to be about those bid into the marriage it's throwing over Revelation 19 there goes my internet I'm like in a bad spot so Please forgive my internet right now. Revelation 19 verse 7 on down. It says, let us be glad and rejoice. See that? Let us be us, the elect. Lord, when will we part of the elect? And give honor to him. For the marriage of the lamb is come. And his wife had made herself ready. We are the Mosai's wife, man. The, the chosen vessels from the nation of Israel. Okay, we about to be um, connected back as one. All right, to our power, Yahweh by Shimei was shy, man. That's just, and Lord, when we are able to stand before Him, before Yahweh was shy, man. Okay, so let us be glad and rejoice and give honor to Him for the marriage of the Lamb. The Lamb is Yahweh was shy. It's come. And his wife had made herself ready. How do we make ourselves ready? Hey man, we 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 we, we threw off what we was doing in the world. We are, we we started following the law, statutes, and commandments to the best of our ability. And we ultimately we are here teaching the right doctrine, man. We threw off that old man. We following the dietary laws, we keeping our high holy days, man. So we're making ourselves ready. And to her it was granted that she should be arrayed in fine linen. Clean and white For the fine linen is the righteousness of the saints And that's what we've been doing Which is a spiritual thing And we all, hey, we're going to be decked out <laughs> In the kingdom, man 
But the, the fine linen is what we're doing right now with this truth, with this information we, 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 um, that we have. And we talking the talk and we are walking the walk. We following the commandments. We are here teaching the right thing. You understand? Hey, we all, you know, came back to one family all over again with the different various camps. All right? And to her it was granted that she should be arrayed in fine linen, clean and white. To her is dealing with us, the elect, Israel. For the fine linen is the righteousness of the saints. And he said unto me, Right blessed are they which are called to the marriage supper of the Lamb. And he said unto me, These are the true saints of the Most High, man. So blessed are we, man. We've been called to this. And, and, and listen, man, it's actually going to be a supper, man. It's going to be a, a big celebration for us. Which we're going to sit at the table and drink that intergalactic wine with Yahweh Shai, man. And we're going to, you know, chop it up, eat some good food. But we got to make it out of this right here, man. Oh, man, the Lord is about to do, some, do, 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 do a work on this fucking kingdom, man. Excuse my language. He's going to do a work on you Edomites. So-called white race, man. Dealing with the elite banking families families okay and, and the rest of you nations has joined under him under this b system the north atlantic treaty organization the european union and america you chinese all you all you freaking heathens man you're gonna bow down man when your shy returns you're going into slavery man under his people that's what this marriage supper is about man all right man man listen and lord when we are found worthy to stand in front of our lord and savior man Deuteronomy 32 and 43. And it says, say, Re Rejoice, O ye nations, with his people, for I will avenge the blood of his servants, and I will render vengeance to his adversaries. Who are adversaries, man? The goddamn so called white people, the Caucasians, the Chinese, the Japanese, the Africans. We're not Africans, man. Okay, the Arabs. Okay, those are our adversaries. And right now they're trying to uh, implement this new world order, bringing the RFID uh, uh, chip, which is, which is the mark of the beast. And some of you bozos out there are going to take it. Lord willing, the most High preserve us until the end. We don't go, we don't have to take that chip or none of that, man. And I will be merciful unto his land and unto his people. That's the elect, man. That's the elect, man. So great times are coming, man. Psalms 95, all we got to do is keep teaching, you know, stay motivated in the spirit, man, encourage one another. Psalms 95, verse 1, it says, Oh, come, let us sing unto the Lord. Let us make a joyful noise to the rock of our salvation, man. That's the, hey, man, that's Yahweh Shai, them angelic, angelic forces, man, them spaceships. Let us come before his presence with thanksgiving. We're well, going to actually come before the presence of our Lord and Savior, man. And make a joyful noise unto him with psalms. For the Lord is, is a great God and a great king above all gods. All right? And all the gods of the nations are idols. And they, and they will be confounded. In his hand are the deep places of the earth. And the strength of the hills is his also. The sea is his and he made it. And his hands formed the dry land. This is earth. Dealing with the earth, planet earth. He did through Yahweh shining angelic forces. Oh, come, let us worship and bow down. Let us kneel before Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Shai, our maker, man. For he is our God, and we are the people of his pasture and the sheep of his hand. Today, if he will hear his voice, harden not your heart, as in the provo provocation, as in the day of temptation in the wilderness. When your fathers tempted me, proved me, and saw my work. Well, it goes on to let it know, man. We're going to bow down, man. And give praise to Yahweh by Shimei And we're not going to, hey, we're not going to be like our forefathers, man. We're not going to murmur. We're going to praise Yahweh by Shimei with all the strength and all our might, man. Okay? So we're moving on. Psalms 45. 10 through 16 it says hearken O daughter and consider and incline thine ear forget also thy own people 
and thy father's house. So shall the king greatly desire thy beauty, for he is thy lord, and worship thou him. Well, the ten. Okay, I'm sorry. And the daughter of Tyre shall be there with a gift. Even the rich among the, the people shall entreat thy favor. The king's daughter, daughter is also glorious within. Her clothing is of rough gold. Okay, that's us dealing with the elect. She shall be brought unto the king in raiment of needlework. Man, we're going to have clothing that's going to be per perfected, man. The virgins dealing with us, the elect, her companions that follow her shall be brought unto thee. With gladness and rejoicing shall they be brought. They shall enter into the king's palace. You're going to get beamed up. Gonna get beamed up, man. Instead of thy fathers shall be thy children, whom thy make it's whom thou mayest make princess in all the earth. So it's not dealing with a woman, it's dealing with the uh, the Israelite men. Princess in all the earth. And I will make thy name to be remembered in all generations. Therefore shall the people praise thee forever and ever, man. So yeah, man, oh, it's going to be glorious, brothers. Glorious times are coming, man. Isaiah 62, verse 5. It says, For as a young man marry a virgin, a young woman, all right, so shall thy sons marry thee. And as the bridegroom rejoices over the bride, which is the, the Israelites, the elect, the bridegroom is Yahweh Shai, so shall thy God rejoice over thee. That's what's coming, man. So I'm going to close out. You know what I'm saying? 2 Corinthians chapter 11, verse 2. And it says, All right. For I am jealous over you with a godly jealousy. For I espouse you to one husband, that I may present you a chaz version to Yahweh Shai. So, man, that's what we're about to receive. We're about to be chaz version unto Yahweh Shai. Yahweh Shai. Lord willing, we, we part of that, the ones that's been called to the marriage. Shalom.